Hello and welcome to my garage. My name is Quad and we are currently going to the parts store to grab a thermostat for this thing because uh, this thing does not have a thermostat and I just let it stall. Yeah, we didn't have a thermostat yesterday. Uh, if you didn't know what it was uh, yesterday, it was that. Can you see right there? Uh, next to that hose, there's supposed to be a thermostat on there. So let's go grab a thermostat. We're also going to grab our blinkers and whatever else we need. A windshield and a liner. Hi. Need anything? And, uh, yeah, let me guess. You're here for the tow jobs. Well, wrong channel, guys. It's a different type of tow jobs. Here's a thermostat. 21 bucks. Let's grab it. Here's the left and right blinker. Let's grab them. Here's the headliner. Let's grab it. Here's the windshield. And I think that's everything. I don't know. I might be missing stuff. Um, let's take the... Yeah, there's the headliner. We're going to get that so off here. So what brings you in today? Dude, I already told you. Uh, there's the windshield. Do we have a wrench on us? I do not. Dang it. I'm going to have to go back. Oh, why's my frame times? Look at that. I'm just getting some screen tearing there. Oh, interesting. I haven't had screen tearing before. Hold on, you guys. Okay, okay. I think I fixed it. I don't see the screen to tearing anymore. I had to turn on my... AMD Hyper RX. Hi. Need anything? Freaking whatever settings. Anyway, I didn't grab anything. Guess what? We're grabbing another wrench and we're going to need a screwdriver. So we're going to grab that as well. It's okay. You can never have too many tools. You know what I mean? I mean, maybe you can, but I don't think you can. Let's put the this on, I guess, first. Yep. And then we're going to have to get some fluid as well. Uh, let's turn our headlamp on and get this tightened one i uh, can't quite see the other side here let's grab this side though there we go just kidding uh, let's take a look yeah we completely drained out our radiator fluid and that's fine uh let's pull out the screwdriver and let's take off the mirror so we can put this headliner on damn it i'm gonna have to change my seat as well i do not like this bart seat um, I guess we'll take these. I wasn't going to. I actually don't even. I only have one of these in my real car. IRL in real life. Uh, I only have the passenger side. The driver's side broke. And I never got a new one to fix it. So whatever. That's in my little Ford Focus. Okay, come off. Okay, the roof's going to fall. There she is. There she is. Let's grab it. Nope. Grab it. Uh, we're just going to throw it on the side. We got the new one right here. Let's slap her up on top. Uh... We almost lost the mirror. Let's put the mirror on first. There she is. Tighten. Let's go ahead and put the visors on. Yeah, this is how my car looks like in real life. Just one. Hilarious. Okay, hold on. And maybe... There it is. There it is. I was going to say maybe we're only going to have one on in this one. There we go. There we go. Okay, jump out, fool. Yep, I think I'm going to get a new seat. Um, Let's just pull this seat out real quick. It's, it's a little bit hard to get into this BART seat. Um, I don't want the bench seat simply because we are going to be using this for like a part runner. And um, I don't like that the seats aren't a physical object. You know what I mean? They just kind of fall through the world. Um, let's go ahead and put on the blinkers right away. Yep, there's that one. Let's grab the other side. We're going to have to get some bulbs as well. Uh, to do that but yeah today's video is all about tow jobs once we're done finishing this up here um we're gonna at least try to bring down all of the abandoned uh, shell cars the ones that we're not doing anything with and hopefully that'll help a little bit uh, on performance and uh loading into the game but what else do we need i think that might be it we got the windshield yep we oh we need a seat yeah 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 okay let's grab a seat can we put a motorcycle seat in there do you think that would be funny if we could sports seats are ugly bulky i don't know what this seat goes into but i think we're gonna grab this one front left uh, yeah it doesn't seem like it's gonna be too high maybe let's jump in it real quick let's act like we're sitting down no that's gonna be just fine okay uh let's just tighten this puppy down and i think we're gonna be ready to go and start our tow job mission today Yep. Oh, yeah. This looks like a really good seat. It's nice and big and thick. Oh, yeah. Uh, it doesn't quite fit perfectly, but hey, you know what? It's enough, okay? Okay, there we go. Um, 
I guess we'll take that. We'll take this. I mean, never hurts to have extra. I don't think there's any... Should we tint the windows? We should probably tint the windows, honestly. Where I'm from, all cars have uh, tinted windows. Uh, tint one. I don't know which one's the darkest. Dang it. I think it's tint four. Let's just grab a tint four. I don't know if it's going to be too dark. I can't remember. Uh, let's just tint these windows, however. Or not. Oh, or not. Apparent oh, there it goes. Those might be too dark. Those might be... Uh, let's just get it inside and see if we can see outside. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, nope, those are too dark. Okay, my bad. Uh, we'll save this for a five-star build. Uh, a car that we're not going to be driving. Let's get the lighter tint. There we go. I think we're going to have to get the tint scraper. Yep. Get it in your hand, fool. Let's go ahead and scrape off this tint here. There we go, there we go, there we go. Um, Sir, I'm just going to leave your tint scraper here. No, I guess we could take it. Let's use this one. Okay, that's a lot better. There we go. I uh, can't forget the tiny window, by the way. Oh, we don't have a window on this side. We're going to have to get windows for that real quick. There we go. That looks a lot better. At least now we should be able to at least see outside when we're driving. Yeah. Okay. I like it. I like it. Let's go ahead and get those uh, passenger side windows real quick. Is a front right. Yes. Oh, damn it. I got the wrong one. Son of a bastard. Uh, there it is. Front right C for coupe. Mm -hmm. Let's get this little tiny front right C. Uh, tiny window. Surprise these. What the hell is this? Okay, my bad. I'm getting uh, upset for nothing. Why would these be different? Oh, damn it. What the hell did I get? Oh, it's a lad coupe. I didn't separate my windows, bro. Bloody hell, did I even grab any of them? Oh my god, I bought a bunch of lad windows. Damn it. Okay, my bad. My bad, that's what I get. Okay, we're in the window section for the proper vehicle this town. Uh, this town at this time. We need the front right small and the front right uh, window window. Let's put the small on first. And then we'll put the window window on second. Actually, let's open up the door and do this because... It's going to be just a little bit easier, I think. Uh, can we hit it? Oh, no, we can't. Dang it. Let's just go ahead and bring our fat heads down. And there we go. There we go. Let's get that other window on. Hey, Tint what? Need new rims? No, I don't need no rims, bro. I'll be guessing what I need. Uh, let's see. Yep, we're going to have to peek our heads in again. One here. And right there. Okay, excellent, excellent. Let's get that tint on. Um, is this the right tent, by the way? I think so, yeah. We can kind of see it's a little bit more clear. Uh, one and two. There we go. That was actually the whole roll. Trash that. Um, put our wrench back in pocket. And I think we're... Oh, exhaust. Exhaust. That's right. Dang it. Let's go ahead and grab the exhaust real quick. Um, I don't know if I'm going to like the exhaust, however. Here is all of the V8 exhaust. They're all pretty long, uh, but we are going to, in fact, uh, grab these little short ones for 180 bucks each. Let's grab our wrench and let's throw them on. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to like the way this sounds. We're going to test out both ways. Um, actually, let's just put these in the back for now, and we're going to test out what it sounds like without ro roaring up this uh, bridge. And then we're going to uh, test what it's like on the way back with them and then we're going to decide if we want the exhaust or if we don't let's drop oh damn it there we go i got it okay let's go ahead and uh see how it sounds without exhaust all right you guys ready we're just gonna roar up the street all five gears how's our fuel okay we're doing okay on fuel all right let's go Okay, okay. Slower down, slower down. Yeah, so it kind of sounds good. It's a little bit jacked at the upper end. It's kind of like, you know, got that speaker blasting sound rate. Um, but it sounds pretty good. It sounds like 
a roaring V8, right? Let's go ahead and put this exhaust on next and let's see how it sounds with the exhaust. Yeah, some of you might be wondering, you know, through all of the episodes and all of the seasons, the two seasons, you know, probably 150 episodes I've done on this game. Some of you probably wonder how come I hardly ever have V8s on my vehicles. And I'll tell you right now, it's because of the sound. I do not like the way this thing sounds. But let's see. Let's see. Jump in. Yeah, see, I can slide up onto this seat a lot better than that uh, BART seat. Uh, let's get her started. Okay, there we go. And now let's compare the difference. slow down don't wreck don't wreck okay well anyway uh let's just head back to no don't go off-roading dang it dang it oh there we go there we go oh we almost we almost broke it we almost broke it dang it let's get over let's get over oh uh, yeah so anyway i think this sounds like crap so we're not going to be rocking exhaust we're going to pull them off uh, maybe we'll pull off one and see how it sounds with one, but yeah, I think we're just going to use no exhaust and I'm just going to adjust the sound levels uh, during post. I watched my whole episode yesterday and I think I did okay with the uh, sound levels, but I think it was just slightly still a little bit too loud. Um, I felt like I needed to kind of turn down my phone a little bit uh, whenever I was driving, so I will attempt to put that down just a little bit lower. Uh, anyway, let's pull this over to the side. There we go. And I forgot to put fluid in this, by the way. S Damn it. I did forget to put fluid in this. Hopefully we didn't break the engine. Um, crap. Get, get over here. Yeah, crap. Let's look at it. Ah, uh, dude, I did. I completely forgot to put freaking fluid in it. We didn't break anything, did we? I'm surprised this thing didn't overheat on us. Criminelli. Anyway, anyway, let's get our wrench back out. We're going to pull that exhaust back off. I don't, like, yeah, because I, I just don't like the way it sounds, uh, which is why I never drive uh, V8s, really. The six-cylinder, in my opinion, sounds more realistic, right? Anyway, off you go. Off you go, you bastard. And then let's just pull this one off as well. Yeah, this would actually sound almost like a, a really good V8 if it didn't, explode the speakers at the uh, top end you know what I mean anyway it's time to do tow jobs uh, let's push the old car up and let's start pulling so we're just going to grab all four of these shells today um, that should help a little bit with the performance and these two I think we're going to keep here uh, this one here we're going to get running again and try to race and all of that but yeah let's jump into the diesel the hooker, I meant to say. Let's jump into the hooker and uh, start pulling. Yeah, yeah. Do we still have the rope on here, by the way? We do. Okay, cool. So, yeah, this should be fun. It should indeed be fun. Uh-huh. Oh, and I forgot. Hold on a second. Before we continue, I need to go to the catalog real quick. And we need to switch it to roof lights. Yes, yes. Damn it. I can't see what these look like. Uh, we're just going to buy all three of them real quick. Yeah, yeah, because I want to put these. Oh my god, these things look hilarious. They're like, um, we'll do the white one, I think, for the tow truck because that kind of matches our thing. Uh, does this have to go on first? I wonder. Oh, I think this might go over top of that. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Let's grab our wrench. I'm assuming it goes on with a wrench rather than a screwdriver. Uh, but yeah, I want to put this onto the tow truck, except for I can't. Why? Because, well, there could be a couple of reasons. One, could be because we have those on there and two it might be because i need that uh brace uh, anyway we need to grab the pry tool real quick so we can pull that off and then we can slap this one on yeah yeah it makes sense to have uh lights on the tow truck this here however we can put this onto our uh pickup there you go there we go yep that looks good that looks good uh let's see if we can put this on now 
jump uh -huh. and dang it oh it can it can excellent stand up fool does that go on with the uh pry tool it does oh okay well that's good let's grab that now i don't know can we turn these lights on and why are they so far forward by the way are they not meant for this truck get back here yeah it feels like that's a little bit too far up oh well i think it's going to be fine let's get in let's get towing yes yes Ted, mum's the word i don't know what that means mum's the word uh because tow jobs is the word there we go let's release that brake slap her into reverse let's get turned around a little bit and uh, let's haul these things uh so this should be fun i think there we go let's just go ahead and hook her up and we're gonna see if we can actually pull this pull this out of here um i was just debating whether i should try to put it up top here i think we're gonna try to put her up top and then yeah yeah i think we'll just try to take as many cars as we can yeah this should be fine uh let's go ahead and hook this thing up let's see if this works with ease there we go and we're just gonna crank her in okay did, did i put the brake on i did i did i always have the brake on uh let's just lower this a little bit there we go so that the has full contact with the tires okay does okay 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 what the hell was that why is this thing bashing up front here anyway uh get this out of the road i think this is going to be fine yep it, it totally is look at it beautiful as can be get over um we're just gonna help push it the rest of the way i'm just joking we're not we're gonna crank it come on baby there you go there you go um let's go ahead and push it on the rest of the way so at least we got one on uh should we try to pull on a second one yeah i think so too i do uh let's just put this crank this the rest of the way in a little bit further please a little bit further look at that tension it's gonna slam my goddamn window let's see if we can just push it forward there we go okay this one's on uh just scooch it a little bit more over and there we go let's unhook it uh-huh uh-huh there we are and then and then and then uh let's just retract that Oh, and I didn't realize, one of you guys uh, let me know that I could have easily just freaking used this to pull vehicles like this. I could just drag it like that. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, and then, and then we're going to grab this. We're taking it off of this. But we are going to hook it up to this which is right there and then we're going to hook this up to this just like that and then i should buy a second one and hook these two up but uh let's see if we can pull all three of these i don't think so but we're gonna try i mean i might be able to do it if i wasn't all back in this little corner and already on a street or something uh let's put in that clutch oh wait we have i was using a clutch wasn't i oh no it is a standard i thought it was on automatic for a second there anyway release the brake let's get it started oh wait hold on hold on there we go and let's see how this works uh let's throw it into first and let's start pulling okay, you guys ready okay okay easy should we uh should we angle out so we can see what the hell's going on here okay you guys ready we got a lot going on here Okay, that's not working whatsoever <laughs> okay stop stop fool stop uh let's see what the heck's going on i don't think i even budged that thing a little bit um did it unhook oh no it's still hooked up it is still hooked up okay i don't think this is gonna work uh maybe if we push it out a little bit further are we okay this thing's like yeah stuck stuck to the ground probably because it doesn't have any wheels or anything uh maybe if we 
stick it upside down or something. You know what I mean? And drag it upside down. Uh, that might be a thing. Let's see if we can flip this over real quick. Go, go. Okay, whatever. Just flip over, bruh. That's all I need. Just need you to go upside down. Okay, whatever. Okay, maybe now uh, we'll be able to pull this. Let's try it again. I don't think so, though. I think I'm just wasting my time here, but... There we go. There we go. Let's try it. Jump in. <clears throat> I wish I knew how to turn those lights on. What if we just turn our regular lights on? Sit down, fool. Oops, we got to put our clutch in. My bad. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Don't hit that tire. Here we go. We got it. Oh, no. This thing does not have enough power. <laughs> Damn it. I think it's that car, though. If it had some basic wheels or something, we might have been able to do it. Okay, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, we are going to, in fact, try to pull this a little bit closer and get it up onto the ramp, however. So let's crank it. Okay, or not, or not. There we go. There we go. Uh, we should be able to pull it now. We're going to go ahead and swing this rear end over just a smidge, and let's see if we can get it now. Uh, at least now it's kind of off of the ground. The one that might be the problem, though, is going to be the Jesse back there. Uh, let's see, though. Okay, easy there, buddy. Jeez. Okay, okay. Come out to the number three key. Um, that tree's not in... That tree's a little bit in the way. I think we got too much... Too much tension on that line. Damn it. Okay, it's not gonna work. It's not going to work. Let go. There we go. Um, you know what we can do? Remove this. And then hook it up to this. And we should be able to at least carry all of this together. There we go. It's off the ground and that should be enough. Okay, let's go. Two at one time. One man and two cars, right? Okay, okay. Let's see if we can do it now. There we go. There we go. Check it out. We got it. We got it. Yes, sir. Oh, damn it. I stalled it. I stalled it. Uh, but I think we got it. Uh-huh. It looks like it's staying on there pretty dang good. So let's get it started back up again and let's get the heck out of here. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Go forward. Okay, we got it. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing the thing. We're doing the thing. We're doing the thing. Okay, slow down. Let's go ahead and come out to this view. Oh, dude, yes, look at this. Look at this. This is what it's all about. All right, all right, all right. Okay, 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 slow it down. We don't want to go too, too fast. Uh, let's push the L button real quick. Oh, man. I forgot to put headlights. Do we need to put bulbs in this, uh, in this light thing on the roof, I wonder? Anyway, let's come out to the first person. I think we're okay. Yeah, I think so. I think so. As soon as we stand up or get out of our seat, however, I'm pretty sure that car should fall off. But I am glad that, uh, I'm glad that he freaking made the beds lock. Like, you know what I mean? Once you sit down, it just locks into place. I mean, it's, it doesn't need to be moving around. So, excellent work on this damn trailer bed. Anyway, let's get backed in like this. And let's get these things parked in here. Oops, we, we killed it. We killed it. That's all right. Let's go ahead and uh, jump out. And yeah, see, as soon as we jumped out, it kind of uh, did its thing. Anyway, anyway, let's go ahead and open up the garage. Which I think we're going to keep all of our shells in bay one. Bay one. 
there we go there we go uh let's see if we can back it in now uh, i think we should be able to sit on sit down and it should lift up again let's find out there we go and let's sit down yep it looks like it worked that way oh yeah yeah check it out check it out <laughs> okay let's get it started let's get it in there there we go shut the door throw her into reverse let's let out that clutch there we go and uh let's back her in beep 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 uh there we go i think this should be good right here uh my my clutch i put it in uh, but dang it it didn't register i don't think so there we go let's just unhook the hook oh where did my hook go the hook's not even on there dude let's look in here no it's on there it's just on the back that's why <laughs> that's why i'll okay, go okay it's fine oh we got the whole thing no no oh we do have the whole thing anyway let's grab the rest of that i had it backwards i think there we go there we go we got it uh let's just bag that up real quick yeah let's push this wolf off the rest of the way take it all the way to the back oh i was pushing the truck the whole time Jeez. stand up fool i think i'm stuck in the bed there we go there we go um let's swing the rear end over just like this and let's see if we can just pull off this car well you know what we could do to pull off that car we can grab this hook again and then what we could do is just hook this car to that car or not i mean yeah let's hook this car to that car and we should just be able to drive away where the hell's the gosh damn hook bruh it's right there yeah and then we should be able to just drive away and it should just pull this car right off right well let's find out if that theory works uh release the brake and let's see uh throw it into first okay hold on hold on i don't know if i'm hitting the walls i think i am there we go there we go Oh, dude, this is not working at all. Damn it. Let's get out. I think it's just pulling that car. Bro, now it wants to pull it with super ease. Okay, whatever. Come off. I think I pulled it off backwards once again. It's fine. Push it all the way back. Yep, let's just keep it all the way back here. And then we're just going to have to push. Oh, damn it. What the hell? What happened? Why is that still connected? Whatever. Just get off, will you? All right, all right, all right. Fine, fine. You guys just do whatever you want, okay? Let's just pull this thing off. And apparently I don't have my brake on because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Just get off here, bro. Just get off. Okay, okay. that should be fine, right? No, because as soon as I take off, it's going to lock. I forgot. That's why I couldn't pull it off because it locks in place. Duh. Bro, I thought we were going to the hell is a door doing down here where did this come from what how did my door fall off oh bro no 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 oh no 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 what is this shenanigans yeah push it back dude i don't think that's supposed to happen no okay well let's just jump in let's see if it fixes it fixes itself once we take off it didn't let's go ahead and start this thing and let's go grab those other two cars. What the hell? Yeah, is it going to hit that damn wall when I come out of here? Look at it. Look at it. Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay, well, let's go. Hopefully that doesn't cause us too many problems. There we go. There we go. Okay, we can't forget radiator fluid, by the way, uh, for our other truck, our, our daily. There's third. Let's go down to second. Uh-oh. I think the door's, the door's dragging. Oh, dude, I can't move. Oh, dude. Let's hit the brake. Okay, okay. Um, do you think it's the door, or did we, uh, do we not have radiator fluid in this either? Oh my god, we don't have any radiator fluid in this either. 
Dude, are you serious? Why don't I have any raid? Oh my god, we already burned out the head on this thing. Shit. Shit, and my door is broken. Oh no. Um, should we just reload, I think, at the, uh, at the thing over there? Oh, you know what? Let's see if we can just pull off this door and fix it. I can't believe I broke my engine, bro. Yeah, this should, okay, this should fix it. And put it back on. Okay, there we go, there we go. Let's go and tighten it back up. No, fool. No. There we go. There we go. And that would explain probably why we couldn't pull those engines. I just blew the head on this thing. Why don't I have fluid in here? I don't know, actually. Hmm. Am I missing a thermostat on this thing as well? I don't think so. Okay, well, you know what that means. It means we're going to have to go to the store real quick and grab some radiator fluid. Uh, let's just call a taxi. It's fine. And then let's just grab a bunch of fluid. Um, we're going to need at least four. Uh, two for each truck. There we go. And let's grab this one as well. Uh, where'd it go, bro? I just saw it fall. Oh, we got all four. Never mind. Nothing fell. Okay. Well, we're going to have to taxi back to the house. And then... Let's drop uh, two coolants off with this truck, and then we're just going to run uh, right over here to do the other ones. Yeah, that's weird. I don't know why that thing has no coolant. Coolant. Oh, well. Oh, well. It is what it is, right? It is what it is. Yeah, damn, man. Oh, yeah, the hooker or... <laughs> um, yeah, it's really, really a strange jump. And uh, let me just get this filled up. Oh, geez. Hold on. Oh, let me get this thing filled up real quick. Oh, God. We lost another cap. Nope. I can see it there. Okay. 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 That seems to look just fine. Let's go ahead and throw that down. Let's put that cap back on. And uh, we're going to throw these into our bag so we can throw them in the trash can. But holy crap. Yeah, we completely ruined the head on this thing. Probably some pistons and such. So we're going to have to rebuild this at some point, uh, which is fine because we were going to, uh, when we did rebuild that, we was going to put performance parts on there. So uh, that's what we're going to do. Not today, but yeah. All right, there we go. Let's throw it into first. <laughs> there we go. I mean, it still seems to run fine enough. Uh, we've only put in 65 kilometers. On oh, geez. We've only put in 65 uh, kilometers on this, or possibly miles. Uh, and we've already freaking busted the engine. Okay, let's go ahead and get these other two vehicles. Um, we're going to have to get back in, of course, so... We're just going to do that. There we go. Let's get turned around here. And let's back in. We'll grab the El Camino and whatever that other car is. The wolf, it looks like. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's put on the brake and uh, let's go ahead and grab these things. Yeah, El Camino and a wolf. Or a Mercedes, right? What the hell was it? Did we already take then? Oh, it was a um, wagon uh, lad. Okay, there we go. Let's hook up the old El Camino first. Yep. And there we go. Let's just uh, even her out. Uh, it's going to be a little bit tricky because our rear end is still kind of high on this truck. As you can see, it doesn't quite hit the ground. Um, but this thing bottoms out really easily, so I don't like to have any lower suspension on here. Okay, this is going to work. That's a little bit stuck here on the lip. Uh, let's see if we can kind of... Okay, maybe not. Nope, nope. I was trying to uh, lift up the front end of that thing a little bit. Uh, so it would pop on. Um, I don't think pushing is going to help. Nope, it's just going to push our truck. Okay, okay, let's try it again. It's going to be a little bit difficult without tires and stuff. Okay, it's going to start freaking out. Okay, we need to unhook it real quick before 
we have a huge accident. There we go. Rehook it back up, please. Okay, well, what we can do to help ourselves, uh, we're just going to lift up the... Uh, we're going to lift it up a little bit. Let's go and drop this, grab this jack, just lift up that front, and it should help uh, help get that on. Yeah, yeah. Let's do that right here. Anywhere. Or not, or not. For some reason, it's actually lifting up our truck. Let's unhook it. Well, it had nothing to do with that. It's stuck on that ramp, I think. Or is our truck just this high? Oh, our truck is just that high. Dang it. Okay, let's lower it again. And I don't know if this is going to work. All right, well, let's try it again. I think we're just going to have to drag it, I think, all the way there. Oh, no, here it comes. Look, there we go. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Get over there, fool. A little bit further. A little bit further. Okay, let's see if we can pull it the rest of the way. We can. Oh, God, it's going to fall. It's going to fall. Get up there. Okay, we got it. We saved it. Nope, we didn't save it. We almost, okay, we did. We did. We almost didn't save it, but we got it. There we go. Get over. Okay, we can unhook it now. Uh, It's on. So that's all that really, really matters. Let's go ahead and drop our hook. And we're going to hook this one up to that car. And we're going to see if we can actually drag it this time. Uh, I think we're going to be able to. There we go. Let's go ahead and lower this. There we go. Let's go ahead and get this jack out of the way. Now, of course, we're lose we're missing a lot of horsepower on this engine because of that damn blown head. But we're going to try to push this as close as possible to the truck first. There we go. Just like this. And now we're going to try to pull it. Uh, we should be able to. It seems like this car slides a little bit better. So there we go. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, get these over to the garage. Okay, it's sitting kind of weird. Uh, let's go ahead and angle ourselves out real quick. Let's throw it into first. Here we go. Bring it, bring it. Come on, baby. Yep, yeah, we got it. A little bit further. A little bit further. There we go. There we go. All right, all right. We got it floored in first gear. The front tires are actually spinning this time. Um, I think once we get out to the road, it's going to pull a little bit easier, but hey, this is working. So far, so good. Even with a blown head gas- or a head, I was going to say head gasket, but it's just a blown head. Okay, and we stalled it. We stalled it. I think we got snagged up on that tree a little bit. Um, let's just hop out real quick. We're going to move it over just a little bit here, so it's not- up against this stupid tree we're gonna help okay yeah you know what okay never mind i was gonna pull it on its hood but um it doesn't want to stay on its hood so this should be fine uh, let's just jump in and let's go let's go there we go release the brake it was already released uh, let's come back out to this angle and let's see if we can pull it again there we go Yep, get on the road. There we go. There we go. Come on, baby. We got it. We got it. A little bit further. There we go. Okay, it's going to struggle a little bit trying to get this onto the road. Let's get it onto the road. Yeah, let's just see if we can push it up onto the, uh, onto the road right here. It's just a little bit stuck on these curbs. Yeah. Okay, there we go. There we go. This should work just fine. Uh, let's get, jump back in. There we go. Uh, release the brake. Just kidding. It was already released. Let's go ahead and get back out to this view. And uh, let's release that clutch. There we go. Check us out. Check us out. We are pulling the woof. Excellent. Let's go ahead and go ahead into first person. And uh, we should be able to do this all the way. Or should we stay out here maybe? Look at it. Look at it. 
getting so silly. It's like sliding sideways. Uh, we're gonna have to downshift to first. Okay, okay. Struggling a little bit. Struggling a little bit, but I think it's working. It's not the fastest way to do it. Um, it definitely was a little bit faster when we had it all hooked up like last time where it was kind of on the ramp and off the ramp. But check us out, bro. This is the dream. This is exactly what I was hoping to be able to do. Okay, don't hit the damn freaking guardrail. I wonder if these guardrails are installed properly, by the way. Yeah, we got it, bros and broettes. Excellent, excellent. Uh, don't hit that freaking thing. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're still in first. Okay, we hit the uh, guardrail a little bit. We're struggling a little bit. Uh, but we have it floored in first gear. I have not let off the throttle. Slow and steady wins the race. I think that's what they say. Yeah, look at this. The hooker. We're hooking. Cool. <laughs> oh, damn it. Yep, the ground is a little bit funky. Okay, cool beans. Well, this is all of the abandoned cars. Um... I don't know if we want to pull anything else down here, but this should help quite a lot. We're just going to pull it right on inside. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's shut it off and uh, let's get that thing unhooked. And yeah, we'll get it the rest of the way inside. Um, anyway, here we go. There we go. There we go. We're going to leave that on. Uh, we are going to back this back out. And reverse the El Camino inside. It just seemed like the right thing to do was pull that other car inside like that. So uh, let's get turned out or let's get pulled out. Uh, let's try not to hit that car. I can't quite see from here, but okay, I think we're hitting it. Um, let's turn around this way. We were hitting it just a little bit. There we go. Okay, let's go. There we go. We got it. Okay, cool. Don't hit the garage. There we go. There we go. Let's go back into first. Uh, this is a bump guard or a bump, a bump, bumper, a push bumper. I mean, and bro, we can't, we cannot even push this thing. Let's give it a little bit of a ram. Okay, damn it. Ramrod, ramrod. Uh, yeah, let's back up a little bit and then we're going to uh, try to ram it just a little bit like this. Okay, 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 okay. I think something else is wrong with the truck. Okay, let's try this again. Try it again. Third time's a charm. Oh. Oh, my, my, my engine. Uh, oh my god, it stalled, you guys. Uh, I don't know. I think we definitely broke it. Um, let's check the radiator again. Okay, we still have fluid. Thank God for that. Uh, should we check the oil? I guess I never thought about the oil. Oh my God, we're really low on oil too. What the hell happened to this truck, man? Okay, well, we're going to have to put a little bit of oil in this. Um, there we go. Let's see if we can just push this in the rest of the way. There we go. There we go. And then let's get some oil, reverse this thing back in. And this thing is freaking trash, dudes. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Look at that beautiful car, though. I think we're going to paint this thing again. I don't like this gray. No, I don't like this gray. Kind of wonder if we should keep this now. Hmm. Anyway, let's get over here. Let's get some oil. I think we need at least a quart, possibly two. And let's dump this thing in. Let's see if we could reach it from here. I might have to jump up onto the truck. Okay, yep, we're going to have to jump up. It's fine. One, two, three, go. There we go. Crouch down, and here we are. Okay, there we go. Let's fill it up. Yeah, dude, what the hell? I'm figuring I'm overheating it, and that's why it was stalling. Um, I would have to look at the gauge on the inside. 
And uh, by the way, one of you guys did let me know on that uh, Coronet. Coronet. Is that how you pronounce it? Cor Coronet. Anyway, uh, let's check the levels real quick before we put the other one in. You know what? It's in between the lines. Um, let's just put the other one in. It's fine. I was not going to, but we're going to. Anyway, uh, the gauges on that car actually work, which is pretty bleeding amazing. Okay, I didn't put it all in. Let's just check the levels. I don't want to overfill it. Okay, it's right at the line. That's fine. I get out of here. Let's put the lid back on. Uh, the radiator fluid said it was good, but sure in the hell don't look like it. Look at that, dude. Oh, does this thing have a hole in it? Our hoses are hooked up. Um, maybe we need to detach and reattach. Huh, did we have the same problem? Is there a freaking water or a thermostat on this? Oh my God, so many questions. Let's get out. Let's take a look at this again. What the heck, bro? We're losing radiator fluid. Um, Let's grab our wrench real quick. And we are in fact going to pull off this hose Pull the hose off, put it back on, make sure it's seated properly. It's not hooked up to the water pump properly, but I don't think that's like a problem, right? Um, let's come around to this side. Let's go ahead and pull the hose off of this side. Okay, damn it. Put your brake on. Uh, let's pull the hose off of this side. Let's make sure it was already tight, and it was. Put it back on. Okay. Um, let's look at the front. I don't see any red spot so pink spot so it doesn't look like it's leaking uh, i don't think these this game has a drain plug right no there's no drain plug right no okay okay well we're gonna have to fill this thing back up again son of a gun i don't know what's going on with that uh yeah let me go grab that and just get it filled real fast okay okay this thing's filled all the way up to the max we're gonna have to keep an eye on it. Um, let's just grab all this stuff, uh, throw it in the trash real quick. Yep, these as well. I know there's a little bit of coolant left in there, but I don't really care. There we go, there we go. Okay, let's get this thing spun around and uh, drop off this Jesse back here, this El Camino, as it was, right? The El Rancho, I'm just kidding. What the hell is the Ford version of the El Camino called, by the way? Is it an El Rancho or is it just a Ranchero? A rancho? Damn it, I can't remember. Anyway, there we go. Um, well, our temperature levels are at low right now, so that's good. But let's get this thing whipped around. That's how you do that. Yep. You guys never did that with a car on the back of a truck like that? Okay, um, let's just back it in to about right here. And then push it off the rest of the way. Uh, we're probably going to move the truck in the process. A jump. There we go. Nope. No, no, no. Jump up here. Okay. There we go. There we go. Let's push it off. Just kidding. Just joking. The truck is moving. Let's push P. Okay. There we go. P works a little bit better. There we go. There we go. We got it. We got it. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Check it out. Let's turn the lights on in this. SOB. Okay. I think I might have to add some new lights anyway. Anyway, there we go. We have all four cars in here. Uh, all four abandoned shells let's go ahead and shut the garage and this should help with a little bit of performance i mean we're getting 60 frames now but okay okay it finally saved that was a really really long save uh, but it should help load the game up a little bit better as well okay okay let's head back up there uh, let's see what we're going to be doing next episode so let's head back to the old homestead thing handles pretty good for a truck I don't even know how well our uh, our new big pickup truck handles yet as far as going around corners and stuff but there we go there we go okay okay let's just pull this back into this little area for now and let's take an assessment of everything that we have up here. Uh, I am getting 60 frames per second right now. 
uh, which is great. And if we come over here, I am still getting 60. Excellent, excellent. I think those four cars actually helped a bit. Let's switch up our graphics though up to best and see how it runs. Okay, it's still at 40 up here uh, with best graphics, but I mean, there's a lot of reflections going on. Still a lot of vehicles. We're going to switch that off. I don't need it to be on best. Uh, there we go. There we go. Anyway, so what's going to be next? Well, frankly, um, how much time do we have left in this episode? Do we have enough time to swap these tires around on this thing? I don't think we do. I don't think we do. Um, I think the next episode, we're going to do a little bit of work around the yard here. We're going to get stuff kind of cleaned up. Um, we're going to swap tires out on this. We're going to be putting those other tires. Yeah, we're going to put these tires on the Niv. Uh, I think it's going to look just fine. Maybe not. I don't know if they're going to fit, actually, now thinking about it. Um, okay, okay. So, I don't know. I was had a big old ramble on what I want to do on the next episode, but I don't even know, to be honest with you. So, who knows what the hell we're going to do in the next one. So anyway, that's going to be it for this one. However, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the toe jobs and we'll see you guys in another one later on, everybody.